When sending out a marketing campaign, you occasionally will want to add lists of contacts to that campaign. Sometimes you'll even need to provide a list of contacts who should not receive that campaign. In this video, I want to show you how easy it is to add inclusion lists and exclusion lists to your campaign in ACT Marketing Automation. Now this works whether you've already activated the campaign or not. My campaign, which is called Welcome New Customers, has already been activated, but maybe I've just been reminded that there are some additional contacts who should and shouldn't receive the emails in this campaign. In order to add an inclusion or exclusion list to this campaign, I have to make sure that those lists exist as groups of contacts in my ACT database. So I'm going to go to my groups area, and here you can see that I've already created a couple of lists. One is called Welcome Inclusion, and one is called Welcome Exclusion. So I'll make a note of these as we go back to marketing automation. It's not possible to add inclusion or exclusion lists while a campaign is active. So I need to go into this campaign and pause it. To do this, I'll go to my actions menu on the right and click pause. Now I'm going to pause this campaign. And from my workflow view, we'll go to the actions menu again. And this time I'm going to choose inclusion lists. With my ACT groups selected here, I'm going to choose the group I'm looking for. So since this is my inclusion list, I'll scroll all the way down to Welcome Inclusion. And then I'm going to click Add Inclusion List. Okay, that list now appears in my screen. So I'll click the Return button in the upper right. And then again from the Actions menu, this time I'll go to Exclusion Lists. And now I'll just choose the Welcome exclusion group and click add exclude lists there we go now when I click return all I have to do now is resume this campaign by activating it again so I'll go to actions and click activate and now because for this campaign the initial send was on a date in the past my inclusion and exclusion lists will not apply to anything that happened on that date up until now I'm okay with that so I'm just going to click Activate Campaign. And now my inclusion and exclusion lists are effective.